<laughs> my friend Danny gave me these glasses. They might not look a little smoky in the bandit right now. Only better looking. No, just kidding. <laughs> I just think it's hilarious. Um, I get by with a little help from my friends. Vacuum line. I think it's a vacuum line. So we're going to change out this line. Um, the, uh, uh, the, um, oh my gosh, on video again. These senior moments are driving me nuts. The, uh, distributor advanced vacuum line. We're going to put on. Sorry for the slow video today, guys. It's We're on day 10. We're in double digits on this trip. And I'm still in California. It's okay, though. Everybody's going to be fine. Line is, uh, is problematic. We're going to change that out. I don't see any vacuum leaks. I did buy a brake clean to see if I can do that. Sorry for the finger on the lens. I hate when I do that stuff. But here's the back of the carburetor and do you guys see any vacuum leaks i mean can't really see them but you know what i mean i'm just studying the heck out of her and uh wanted to do this last night so i'm gonna do it today but uh that's what she looks like We'll figure it out. We always do. This car's going to go in New Jersey. Probably during the election, which should be interesting with what everybody's projecting. Vacuum leak. We will find it. We are still having carburetor issues. So I don't know if we got to get another one or what the situation is, but there's no vacuum leaks on her. And the uh, idle screw is almost all the way out now. And there's no vacuum leaks. Good hose for the vacuum advanced. And uh, choke is not affecting it. And she is not starting. The carburetor mystery continues. Might get a new one. Let me rephrase that. We might get a replacement one for the new one we have on there another new one because it's a little bit frustrating but it's okay it's all good we'll get it done all right carburetors coming off to inspect the underside here we go well the feedback we're getting is to take off that spacer so we're losing the spacer and we're con connected to the back of the carb also when these are um if you tighten up the uh, idle screw, you can close these off completely. I'm going to put them in a medium position before I install it.